Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick trick of how to create a cool gender uh, analysis chart with a function called people graph. Um, so let's say the scenario is that you have the headcount of uh, different departments by gender and then you want to show it uh, in the chart. And of course, there are many ways to do to do that. You can use the bar charts whatsoever. But then today, um, I want to show you how to use the people graph. So this is a function, the add-in available in Excel 2013 and above. So what you need to do is really to go to store here. Um, well, you, you are in the insert tab and then go to stores. Um, and uh, you are going to try to look for people graph. And then this is an add-in that you, um, you need. And then you just add it. Um, and then it's going to show up here as people graph or it's going to be in your My App um, here. So what you need to do after you install it, um, just go to people graph, click on it. This is the opening page that you're going to see. Um, and then what you need to do is actually pretty simple. Like go to the data, uh, uh, the data icon here. Um, title is where you need to type in your title for the chart. And in our chart, I'm going to name it as male versus female female this is just my way of naming it uh, and then after you do that uh, go to select your data and then you need to select two columns in your excel spreadsheet so in my case it's going to be this for the mail create and this is how you're going to see it so how do we do the female part so Unfortunately, people graph does not allow you to show two sets of data here. So I, I actually need to have a workaround for it, which is actually um, reformat my original formula a little bit. And then um, so that the female headcount and departments are side by side and then go to people graph and then essentially uh, do another chart with the female headcount, go create. And here you have the uh, female account with the create. And then now what you need to do is actually use your snipper chart, uh, snipping tool here, um, and then snip it to be in the format that you want. Oh, um, I have, um, so it looks like that I actually need to get rid of my, uh, point focus so I can copy it more neatly. Yeah, so that's how it's going to look. And then I'm going to copy it and then paste. Uh, paste. You can see I have it here. Bring to the front. Let me bring it to the front. Uh, okay, so I guess I can not. Um, let me see if I can bring it to the front. Okay, I guess not. So, okay, so now actually what we need to do is to paste both of those charts into, say, PowerPoint or Word. So let's say uh, this is a PowerPoint slide that we want to uh, have the graphs on. The first thing you need to do is like the original one here. Uh, you just copy and paste here and then set it uh, in a proper, set it in a proper size as you wish and then remember what we just did for the female part copy it and then paste in here so you see actually we have it um, exactly in the exactly the same size as what we have for the male part and then just organize it to make sure they are perfectly aligned there as it is and then now as you click out of it, this is essentially how your PowerPoint is going to be like and then people are going to understand this part is for the male and this part is for the female. Okay, so this is how we use the people graph um, in Excel to create uh, a gender analysis chart and uh, I hope that you find it as fun as I do. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel if you like it. If you have any question, please leave me a comment and I will talk to you very soon.